Howdy howdy everyone, this is JP here. Today I'm gonna teach you how to do helipops. It's warm for f sake. Alright, time to break down the helipop. The helipop is a nolly backside 360, and frankly, it's not that hard, but in my opinion, it's a really cool trick. It's another old freestyle trick, and of course, you can combine it with street skating. Before you begin, make sure you have a solid nolly and nolly backside 180s. This will help you a lot. If you have the 180, then you're already halfway. So let's start with the foot placement. You want to have your front foot a little bit angled on the nose and your back foot around the bolts or wherever you feel comfortable. Remember to let your toes hang over the edge. This will help you keep control over the board during the rotation. Start off by doing backside 180. Keep your eyes on the board all the way and aim for the tail with the back foot to help you pivot the last part. Sometimes you will under-rotate or over-rotate, but it doesn't matter as long as you land on the tail and guide yourself the last part. The key is to use your shoulders to help you get the full 360 rotation, so use them properly. So what can go wrong with this trick? The first problem you will encounter will probably be under-rotation, and this is okay, it means you're on the right track. Even though you land 270, you can roll away from it, but it will probably not count in a game of skate. The other problem is over rotation. This can be a bit scary since you can spin out of control, so try and stay away from that. And last but not least, there's a chance you will miss the tail with your back foot. This can stop the rotation short. And don't try too hard and do something crazy with your arms if you don't succeed in the beginning. Try to do the 360 in one fluid motion. It's even possible to do this trick without any pop, but of course, you want to pop it because it looks better. Take a look from this point of view and keep an eye on how my feet works together. Try and do helipops wherever you feel like. It's really fun to play around with and experiment with different combos, but try not to get dizzy. Thank you for watching. If you have further questions, ask away in the comment section. I hope this was helpful. In that case, leave a thumbs up, subscribe and I'll see you again in the next video.